it is Crystal with Pineapple Papers, and I am playing along with a Pizza My Heart um, challenge over on Paper Issues. Now, of course, I've done a little bit of um, pre-work. Um, so this, <laughs> this stitching took um, a few days. So this is a free cut file from Paper Issues called Stitching Hearts Background. It's a free cut file. Um, so I just downloaded it, I cut it out, and then I backed it with a piece of, uh, paper from Paige Evans. This was from Bloom Street. And then I took some Spiegel Mom scrap sequins. I showed you those in the beginning. I believe they are sweet things, uh, frosted evergreen and tweaky teal twerky teal tweaky I'm not sure um but they were in the beginning and if you need to know please leave them down below I'm not really sure that they are still available um there was no rhyme or reason to what I chose as far as the sequin um went I just basically didn't want the same sequin next to each other so I used white and blue embroidery floss and I just used two or three, let's see. I used three strands and went all the way around. I did avoid the middle where I knew my photo was gonna go. So my photo is a picture of my husband and daughter and we are at the Candy Baron on Pier 39 in San Francisco. And they have the best taffy in the world. I mean, maybe I haven't tried all the taffy in the world, but I have tried my fair share of taffy. And um, I am addicted to this one. Um, I do believe you can have it shipped. Um, so that may be happening, honestly, because, oh, delicious. And we are out. <laughs> I want to say we bought like mm, six pounds of it, like. We bought a lot. Some of it went to the office, but some of it did not. And it's it's just beyond delicious. So, of course, I took a picture. I have another picture that I might scrapbook later, too, that's just the taffy. I'm not sure. I thought this one was cute with her in her bucket. So, I actually stitched around my photo and then I backed it with a couple of the cut apart sheet and um, I'm going to add a few stickers from the sticker sheet from Bloom Street uh, showered with love and then I used the uh, the tiny words and I think those were from Maybe go the scenic route. Um, it says so many. No, they were from Wonders. They were definitely from Wonders. And um, then I am going to go into my uh, Killer Kit with Style. And I am going to pull out some Best Day and Peaceful Heart ephemera pieces, chipboard pieces, and florals. Um, some of those items are still available in the paper issue shop. That's where I got them from. And uh, I added a little chipboard piece to the top of that tag. It says photo op because, yeah, this was definitely a photo op. I didn't want to put too, too much um, in there, but I do create your visual triangle on three of the corners of the photo and gosh like that's that's pretty much it um I do so there's there's where I'm trying to figure out what my title is going to be I liked the so so I knew that had to go on um and this is where I'm going to pull the mini so mini because there are so many different flavors and the funny thing is when you buy all these flavors of taffy, like you don't remember what they are. You just like reach in the bag and um, pray you don't get the dill pickle one that you had to put in the bag because you had to try it and then you put it in there and you have no idea which one it is. 
yeah, we did that. It wasn't bad. It was just weird. <laughs> so, um, wouldn't recommend that. I pretty much love everything dill pickle. Not sure I'm a fan of a taffy dill pickle. So there is that. I grab a couple of other sequins to just scatter about so they're not the only ones that are hanging out um, in the sewing. And that is going to do it. So head over to the Facebook group and uh, play along with this challenge. So I guess I should tell you what it is now that it's over. So basically you create a project in the shape of a pizza using triangles. I used, you know, the cut file. So there's my code if you need to go shopping and remember to wear your crown and I'll see you next time. Bye.